Hey guys, your inner chakras. Happy Saturday. I didn't think I was going to make it. I didn't think I was going to make it today. It's been a busy day. It's been a busy weekend. Oh my God. Started yesterday, but I'm here. I'm available. I'm still running around like a chicken with my head cut off, but I made it to the room. That's all that matters is I'm in here now. And I'm pulling in all your energy. Bring it on in. Bring it, bring, bring it, bring it on in. You want it. You, you want it. Bring it on in, right? Bring it on in. I'm gonna see what's going on with you and then your boo. Or somebody else's boo that you don't know and you think is your boo. Ooh. I know, right? I know. Hopefully this is a good read. I can't, I, I don't know. I got, I got to, you know, get into it. Holy Spirit, what do you have for the collective, guys? What's going on around you? What's in your energy, right? You have anchor. You have stability in your life. You got it going on, girl. You got it going on. You have stability. You have a home. You have a place to stay. You have a place to rest your head. You have a job to go to. You have stable friends. You have stable family. You have good neighbors. You know, it's decent. It's, yeah, you have stability. Your bills are paid. Everything is current. All of that, you have stability. You are anchored. See that anchor? You have stability in your life, guys. So that's good. Consistency is good. Stability is even better. Holy, Holy Spirit, what is going on? Divine guidance. So you've been, you're being divinely guided right now. All right, divine guidance. You could be been doing a little praying, asking for guidance, all of those things. And then we have unlimited potential. It's infinity. Forever, ever, forever, ever. I just saw 212. All right, guys. So you have stability. You have divine guidance and unlimited potential. So guess what, guess what unlimited potential means, guys? It's only up from here. It's up. It's up from here. Guys, don't be signing no contracts with nobody. Definitely don't sign no contracts with Diddy. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. All his contracts are dirty. And if you do, you better read the fine print. You better read the fine line. Because there's a paragraph in there that says, I'm going to F you over. Hmm? If you deal with me, right? And I think a lot of people didn't read that one little paragraph. Anyway, guys, bricks and pillows. What's going on in your love life? Oh. Oh. Somebody says, I'm married. Unhappily married. And then it says, I'm coming. Wait for me. Woo. All right, guys. If those cards come out. They were meant to come out. Holy Spirit. What's going on in your love life, guys? Feel, the, feel, feel, uh, feel free to fit the energy. It could be you person you're thinking about it could be both energies they can rotate they can flip at any time i'm not the person you remember good bad or indifferent they're telling you that they've changed right they've changed i'm not the person you remember i'm not the same i've changed hopefully they change for the better all right what's going on with this person spirit they're in their feelings right now they're in their feelings laid up in the bed Definitely in their feelings. They're not the person you remember. Holy Spirit, what's going on? Mm, somebody's wearing a mask. Spirit is coming in. Spirit's like, nope, this is your divine guidance right here. Somebody's wearing a mask and it says, liar, cheater, beware. So, even though they're not the person you remember, they're going to come in. They may going to tell you, I changed. I don't see you no more. I'm not this. I'm not that. This person is still wearing a mask. They're still a liar. They're still a cheater. So beware. Beware of this person. Holy Spirit, if they're not the person the collective remembers, then who is this person? Who are they today, Spirit? energies that want to come through who is this person today make them show up spirit they're standing in their strength whoever they are they're fighting off dragons who is this person 
they feel like they made some bad choices in their life they feel like they chose wrong with the seven of cups in reverse and they're definitely in their feelings about it maybe they feel like they made some wrong choices eight of wands in reverse they're not going anywhere fast right they're going nowhere fast eight of wands in reverse This person has healed. Maybe they're telling you that they have changed or standing in their strength. They're ending a relationship. Two of Wands in reverse. Yep, told you. They feel like they chose wrong. Two of Wands in reverse. It looks like they could be ending something or they're just not making any moves yet, right? But they do want balance in their life. They want to make things right, right? They want to equal the give and take. Maybe that's what they want from you. This person is burdened. They're trying to heal, but they have a lot of burdens. They're carrying a lot of problems with them, or whatever whatever they're carrying. Carrying, they have a lot of a lot of burdens. They're a hangman. They don't know. They feel like they chose wrong in a connection. That's why they're in their feelings. But they don't know if they should stay or go. Uh, in this connection so they're kind of like in hang just hanging around trying to figure it out don't know what to do blood is rushing to their head look at that mm -hmm. can't stay upside down for too long all right holy spirit but they do want balance in their life this person wants to be happy now they want the sun card so they want balance in their life holy spirit clarify the seven of cups in reverse what did you choose wrong you had seven choices Whatever they chose wrong, guys, they ended it. They ended it. And now they have the Ace of Pentacles. They're getting another chance to try all over again. They're, or they're Either that or they want another opportunity with you. Holy Spirit, clarify these burdens. What is burdening this person? Page of Swords in reverse. Deception. Maybe all the deception that they've done to other people, right? The Spirit said this person is a liar, cheater, beware. This is a King of Wands. This person has something to say. What do you have to say? They're on a karmic wheel. They're on a karmic wheel. It's in reverse. It's in reverse. What is delaying this person? Two of Wands in reverse. Five of Pentacles in reverse. They got to get their money right. Nine of Swords in reverse. They're not up in their head, though. They're not in their head anymore. But they're not making any moves. It's like they're going back and forth. They're just keeping themselves busy, keeping themselves working. There was no victory. And whatever this person was in, whoever they chose, it didn't work. So that's why they're coming back to you saying, I'm not the person you remember, right? I don't know about any change here. All I know is something happened in their current relationship. And now they want you back. They want balance. Spirit, clarify six of pentacles. King of pentacles in reverse. They could be single. Now they want balance in their life. Ace of Cups. So this person, after they come out of this connection that they're in, where, whether they had a choice between you and another or you or them and other people, now they want to offer you this Ace of Cups. They want to be happy. This is the King of Cups in reverse. This person don't love nobody. <laughs> they're not loving nobody. Lovers in reverse. Okay, so they're taking their love from someone. Because they're choosing happiness now, right? Whatever they tried to make happen with this relationship, it didn't happen. Right? It, it just didn't. It didn't happen. Holy Spirit, clarify their strength. They're definitely in their feelings. They're all over the place. But they're standing in their strength trying to make changes. Three of Pentacles. They want things to work in their life. They want teamwork. They want something. They have no regrets. 
about these changes, four of wands is in reverse. Something ended in this person's life. Or they ended something. Now they're in their feelings. Huh. Holy Spirit, why is this person in hangman? They're a hangman because of all the betrayal that they've done. The seven of swords, all the backstabbing that they've done to other people. So I guess they changed these little naughty little ways. Six of Cups, guys. They're definitely coming back to the past, but they're sneaking. They're sneaking. They're still in that way. That's what Spirit said. They're still in that way. Be careful. It's a King of Swords in reverse. I don't know if this person is coming in to manipulate you. They are in the Seven of Swords with the King of Swords in reverse. And they're coming back to the past. So, guys, they're going to come back with manipulation. So, be careful. Rosie, you are about to get kicked out because I do not want to hear snoring. Holy Spirit, clar clarify this liar, cheater, beware. This person is frustrated. See, eventually, being a cheater, being a liar and all that stuff, it eventually catches up with you when you're older in life. They don't want to hold themselves back anymore. Ten of Cups in reverse. They are into something, guys. They're coming to you. They're sneaking and doing it. Whatever. Spirit, clarify the Seven of Swords. Eight of Cups. Okay. So somebody did to them what they've been doing to others because they're walking away from the Seven of Swords. They're either walking away from this energy and trying to get back to the past or they're walking away from somebody who betrayed them, lied them, did some underhanded stuff to them the same way that they did to others. So now they're walking away and they're in their feelings. Queen of Swords. They're definitely making decisions for themselves, guys. And they want justice. They want to make things right in their life. I don't know. I don't know what you're going to do, but whatever. Here's the thing about people from the past coming back, right? The choice is yours. You can get with this or you can get with that. You can get with this or you can get with that. You can get with this or you can get with that. You can get with this because this is where it's at. I don't know. But this person was a liar, cheater, beware. But then I think they've also been lied and cheated on too. But see, the funny thing about a cheater being cheated on when it happens to them they can't take it they can't take it stop setting fires right because then somebody eventually is going to set a fire on you and then it is what it is but they're not the person you remember now they want something out of life they don't want to be this person anymore i don't feel good about this energy it's like they're they're on a seesaw they're up down up down up down I don't know. We need somebody who's a little more direct. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.